So from outside connection, get this feeling of, of a connection where you're, where you're pushing in and the push is from, from here, not, not here, not here, but from here. Almost as if the hand's cupping back into your body again. Okay, and then make the tenkan. Uh, you, your partner is required to maintain his grip. So there's the connection. Your partner maintains his grip right throughout the movement. Connect. Tenkan. Connect. Tenkan. Connect. Tenkan. Look where you're ahead. Make sure that you're in good position after your ten can. And the leading foot is out turned. Okay. So you're moving, turning, and endeavouring to stay in the same position. Come back with a side. Here. Here. Come back. So my connection is here, here. So that's the, the same feeling as the connection. Here, that's the connection. Then the turn. Then the turn. So this side, connection, turn. Connection, turn. Connection, turn. And also note that I'm more or less making the connection absorbing the punch or reacting to the punch as I move off the line, then turning. So I'm not turning and then picking it up halfway. I'm reaching out to take it and then I'm turning. Just like from here, here, there. There's my connection, there's my turn. From the punch, there's my connection, there's my turn. So there's a bit of timing involved there with that part of the technique. Uh, for this particular uh, movement, I want to connect with his elbow. I want to connect with his elbow. So as I move in, I'll connect with the elbow here. Finish the ten count off and then slip to the hand. So there's two movements there. One, two. One, two. But what I don't want you to do is go straight for this. Because you'll get a, a bad reaction from that. So from the punch, he feels nothing because I haven't engaged or connected with him. I've moved off the line, I've connected with his elbow, but I haven't interfered with it. I've just connected with it. Then I'll slide to the wrist. So elbow, wrist. Elbow, wrist. Elbow, wrist. Keep them separate. Don't go wrists. Keep the, keep the movement separate. So it's elbow, wrist, elbow, wrist, separate, okay? Then that. So it's two separate movements. It's elbow, then wrist. Other side, elbow, then wrist. Elbow, wrist, and tenka. Separate, all separate, all separate. Again, this side, elbow, wrist. This side, punch, elbow, wrist. Elbow, wrist. Elbow, wrist. Keep them separate. So once you've connected, once you've connected with the elbow, once you've connected with the elbow, Slide to the wrist, elbow, wrist. And I'll start getting into sync the more you do it. This side, elbow, wrist, elbow, wrist, elbow, wrist. Keep the movement separate. Because if I keep the movement separate, I am not committed to this yet. So I, I can still use the elbow. So I'll come here. Elbow, okay. 
elbow, wrist. Got the guy. So I've got so they're separated now. I'm not committed to this. If I did this, I'm totally committed to this. And I've just used all the body strength. But if I come this route, one. Yeah. I've got some good aggie going now because I've just utilized the elbow part of it on the in the tank arm. Tank arm. Elbow, wrist, technique. So it's all separate. I'm not committed to anything yet. Elbow, ten car, ten car back. Yeah. So the preciseness is help, wrist, other side, elbow, wrist, using tension, elbow, wrist, elbow. Wrist, elbow, wrist, elbow, wrist, so you can switch to everything separated. Elbow, elbow, can, elbow, elbow. So I've got loads of options now because I've kept things separate. I've got here, elbow, wrist, ten car technique. So the more you do this, the more you do this, one, two, one, two, one, two. The more you can fly out, I can just use one and go somewhere else. Or I can go one, two and go somewhere else. Because they're all separate. It's teaching your body to do what it's supposed to do. You're telling your body what to do instead of this autopilot because we've done that move so many times before we tend to go into autopilot so now we're separating things elbow wrist technique elbow 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 Elbow, wrist, elbow. All separate movements and not rushed. And in order to do that, you maintain flow. So you can't slow it down as long as you mean elbow, wrist, wrist. As long as you maintain flow, you can slow it down. But if you go fast, then you lose all the bits and pieces. You lose all components that are built into the, the technique. So let's go back to elbow wrists. Mm -hmm.